Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. I want to get into the music, man. Right, right. I want to get up. I, I, first, I, I want to say, man, you have done an extraordinary jo- job uh, going into the music. I think of you. I think about, I, I really, I think about the Jay Princes. I think about the uh, Masterpiece. I think about the Birdmans, you know what I mean, in the South. Mm-hmm. Um, and I look at you and what you're doing, and I, I put you in these categories because it's promising to see something new. You know that transpires in the music. I've been dealing with music ever since rap came to mm-hmm. the scene. I'm an older cat, and I just I, I'm a, I got a heart for music. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. Um, and when Jay Prince and them did what they done, uh, I definitely was I was in cahoots with it. Uh, like I said, Master P was one that came kind of behind him, and then you got of course Birdman. Mm-hmm. Um, I. That's the only ones I kind of consider. I'm kind of biased. I like I like who I like. <laughs> I'm a, I like the bosses, man. You know what I'm saying? So when I think about that and I think about what you've done, thank you for the music, man. Right. You know, uh, starting off, like I say, uh, I think I seen somewhere you 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 became friends, I guess, with T. Ferris. I don't know how that relationship started. Right. No. Well, we uh, me and T. Ferris knew each other from Little League baseball. Okay. So y'all already knew yeah, each other. Yeah. Like nine, ten year old kids. You know. So um um. That's pretty much knew him, so, knew him early on. So y'all baseball. knew each y'all grew up together. We didn't grow up together. We knew each other during baseball season. You know? Okay, cool. Yeah, he so played he, ball. Baseball. Yeah, he played ball. He played on another team when we was younger. I played on the, the winning team. And, <laughs> like um, he said, I played on the winning team. So, and, uh, <laughs> and you know, towards the end of the year, you know, uh, you get to pick up players and stuff like that. And then y- y'all have like this little all star team. And then you go play state. You know, I won state four times. Back there, and uh, you know, it was like it was just like one. It was an all black, all black baseball league that you never, you probably never seen this before, and never seen it again. But from age eight to fourteen, they had all these teams. Uh, everybody was black. The parents, you know, was real organized and. Uh, you know, did stuff together, and it was like one big love, little, little happy family back there. So, so I'm, I, and when I heard you speak on, I heard you say that when you got out of. When you retired from baseball, right. you went directly into the music. Right. And when you went directly into the music, you and T. Ferris kind of, you moved him in with you or something? Yep, I moved him into my house with him. I'm the type of person like my coaches would tell you. I wish I was your friend. <laughs> 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 I'd move in with you. And well, then you'd hey, be listen, like, look, hey, man, hey, look, hey, man, hey, 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 I move hey, in. Nah. You, 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 let me, I, I can move to Houston. Listen. Nah, I'm going to do music, <laughs> man. <laughs> <laughs> you see I got in trouble nah, right now? Nah, nah, nah. nah. Uh, it's just uh, you know, I'm a quick learner. I, I'm, I'm my coaches will tell you, I, I, I pick stuff up quick. I, you give it to me, you ain't got to tell me too many times, and I want to know. It's same thing with him. I just knew that I'm behind. I know he had all the information, so I'm the type, you know, going to pick you up and doing this stuff. I wanted to know about music. I wanted to wake up talking, breathing music every single day, you know, and just put it in my system as much as I could. The only way I can do that is by moving you in with me. So when I moved him in with me, you know. As soon as we get up, you know, it's a hey, conversation. Yeah, it's like all throughout the day, we riding through the city. We just constantly, just constantly talking about what we're going to do, how we're going to do it, and things I need to know, you know. So it was just like, I was just like putting all that information into my body before I did any, anything, you know. I, wow. So. How long before you actually did that were you thinking about starting this business? No, I was already thinking about starting a business. It was, I did that for like a uh, six to eight months before I put out music. You yeah. know? Right, you but know? how long before that did, were about, you... Thinking about this? Right. Oh, this idea came up in about like 2008. You were playing baseball, oh, okay. though, but so you couldn't you focus still, all the way yeah, on it. Right, yes, so yes. you already knew that's what you wanted to do when yeah. you were exiting. Yeah, I knew that's what I wanted to do. I knew a lot of guys had tried it, and I didn't want to... You know, when I thought about doing it while I was playing, I was like, when I looked around, I said, nah... Um, this you ain't gonna be able to do this while you playing. You know you gonna have to like your focus. You gotta put your whole yes it's everything gonna, into it. You ain't gonna it. be able to have one foot in and one foot out. Mm-hmm. So I realized that early, and I just laid back. You know until you know it was time for me where I could strike and just do it all the way. Like did T like T Ferris? I know like I, and I want to stay on that a little bit. After you showed him all, well, he showed you everything that was going on with the music, and you pretty much, you and him, was was it a thing where you, was it uh, a thing where you, you kind of paid him for co- consultation? Yeah, everything. I you see what this, I'm saying? I paid this guy, I paid this guy every month, you know So you I'm paid saying? for consultation? Yeah, I paid him every month for consultation, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101.